a nicer view parked outside the house here than any of the windows in the house. See the mountains down the street. I'm happier in the van. People understand what I'm talking about. I'm actually an introvert. I just need to be by myself. Anyways, the, the windows. Imagine if you're sleeping with your head right here and somebody decides to break the window. They're not getting through this plastic. It's 420 somewhere. Okay. So I went to a plastic store and I got here my van. It's polycarbonate. You may have heard of Lexan. It's the strongest plastic. It's what they use for bulletproof glass. Oh, super expensive. Custom cut. I just drilled the holes in them. I'm trying to get them mounted. Any major work on this van, I put in the AC and I kind of took a break for a while. Templates that I made. I cut out this plastic to my template. Put these up with clamps. I'm gonna drill the holes. love these back windows the truth is i don't really have to do much i could just look outside at night i leave these closed every layer adds extra insulation and that's really uh what these are about double pane of glass real double pane glass there's gas in between this is not as effective as a, an actual double pane it's tinted but at night you can't really see but if you get close, the same thing happens. Let's go outside. Let me show you. You can't really see. It's, it just looks weird because you can tell that there's a window inside of a window. Friends got a little weirded out when they first saw the van. They're like, is that, that looks like a security van. You've never seen anything like it. It's like a double reflection. At night, you just see right through. Block view. They saw my video. They've already given me a free camera. And then like, hey, you need another camera? You need a longer coaxial cord? They sent me this 30 feet. This, oh, so as I'm doing it, I found this box in here. It was unconnected, so I, re I reconnected that thing up. Now I have a backup beeper. I wanted to run the wire through this, which is spring-loaded. It's for the license plate wire. And Look, I just fed it right through the end. It was really easy to just feed it through the factory wire location for that side door. One of the things that I saw people did that I really liked, they took away all the features that made a van look like a van inside and really made it look like a home. So having those back windows, which I love, I thought it would be good to paint the area black under my plastic panel glass so that it just looks like less of a van. I do think I've accomplished that. What's the temperature outside? It's 96 degrees Fahrenheit. It was 100, so it was so hot today. It's even hot to stand on the grass right now. 94 degrees in there. It was 120 degrees inside the van. Glass right here is so hot. This partition's really doing its job where the sun's hitting. Finally get the insulation in. Huge difference because the ceiling is not that bad where there's insulation. Next to it, it's 120 degrees when I hit the laser on there. That's a little better. 89 degrees. The Lexan panels. Well, I'm gonna need some uh, white gloves or some kind of gloves. I don't wanna put fingerprints all over the panels. It is 78 degrees in here. So much better. I put on pants because the mosquitoes keep biting my ankles. Well, they did get me right here, but they're not, they're biting my ankles mostly and it hurts for like a day or two. They hurt so bad. Little screw first to hold it in place. I think like, okay, I got it all figured out. I just hope that once I get these things up that I'm not gonna have to take them back down again. I don't know if this camera is lined up right. My rear facing camera and it's about to get covered up. It's Saturday night. It's not nighttime yet. Saturday. These uh, panels were $250. Finally, for the first time, you're gonna get to see what they look like. Last thing you want after all this work is for it to not work out. Hope these gloves aren't leaving any marks. I plugged it into the house. It's kicking on. 122. It's insane. My van, what? I set this thing for 79. The temperature is 77. I needed these washers 
Yesterday, I went to the hardware store. I got everything I needed except for the washers and then the hardware store was closed. Finally, I can get this back up. I got this one in. I also ordered 16th inch neoprene from Home Depot. I'm gonna make a gasket here because this just doesn't look the way I wanted it to look. So with the neoprene gasket in there, I think it's gonna look a lot better. I think I sleep better because of this. Break the window on purpose by accident. They are not breaking that inside pane. Quarter inch polycarbonate. This thickness is what they use in the CNC machines. Parts go. And when this is closed, it looks like this. You do not see the camera. Well, here, you know what? Let me go inside and close it. Some sort of security or homeowner. They're not going to know what they're seeing. Hey, anybody in there? Light on the dash cam. It's so subtle and the way it reflects, it's really... But then, of course, if you're far away, you can't even tell that it's there. Proper masking tape and I left a little bit of the white for the door. It's all flush. I'm happy. That's what matters. I ever make a mistake or I feel I made a mistake, you're going to know about it because I'm going to fix it and I'll make a video about it speed editor i really like it if you're like oh i want to make videos every editing software is tough to learn you might as well pick the one that's free the free version for learning is perfect i didn't want to get into this why i hate adobe i went to cancel it because i just couldn't afford the 53 dollars a month for the whole suite they pulled this thing like oh hey we'll give it to you for like half price or less than half price for a year if you don't cancel if you just cancel they'll give you a huge discount since you're not doing that and you're being loyal they're just going to take all your money and give the people that aren't loyal discounts. I don't like companies that do business that way. DaVinci Resolved, it's not monthly. If you buy the pay version, people that bought version 12 years ago get free updates every time they come out with a new version. They don't have to pay for it. So just saying. And, and more pros use DaVinci Resolve than use Adobe Premiere in Hollywood. 